Yeah, this all dates back to a game exactly two weeks ago today. Now that video now the subject of debate here in this community, and it's also led to the suspension of that coach as well as an internal investigation. It's up. It December 20th, fourth quarter, East Hampton with a 24 point lead over Valley Regional. This video posted on YouTube by Valley TV shows coach Sean Russell apparently push a team member into a position on the court. The teenage girl nearly loses her footing. This video garnering more than 11,000 views as of Tuesday afternoon. Now, exactly two weeks later, East Hampton Public School Superintendent Paul Smith confirming to Fox 61 that Russell, who is also the athletic director, is currently not with the program. In an emailed statement, Smith said, quote, regardless of the excitement of an athletic contest, we expect our coaches to temper their behavior to represent the high ideals of the East Hampton Public School. As a result of the incident of December 20th, Coach Russell was suspended for a period of time immediately following the game. The coach is currently on leave while the district does a complete investigation of the event. And East Hampton is in the Shoreline Conference. I was able to catch up with a parent who's now reacting to the district's decision. Take a listen. I think that's an excellent first move by the school's administration. The reason why myself and others are outraged is because our daughters have played in that conference and have seen this coach's behavior in the past. Uh, but the physical laying hands out of a player, entering the court during play, shoving a player um, is just above and beyond anything that could be tolerated. And I also spoke with other parents off camera who say that that push was just a normal part of coaching and they think that this is all an overreaction. We're live in East Hampton, Samaya Hernandez, Fox 61 News.